Is that thing pretty soft? You feel it. Oh, kill him. Oh, oh, kill him. had so many gyms lined up but the first place we went to was a metro fight club as as we're there my dad we're watching through the window or my dad's just uh watching him holding mitts for the guy and my dad's just pointing out the small things like look at him he's so relaxed he has that guy relaxed shoulders not overthinking just doing basic stuff that works every single time like my dad was like we're not going anywhere like, we're not going anywhere. We're not going to any other gym. This is the gym that we're going to be at. It was an eye-opening experience that there is a lot to learn. And I'm far behind. And if I need a car from the very beginning, it's just a matter of refining his technique. He has great instincts. He makes good choices when he's in the cage. So that's what keeps his fight short, because he's always making good choices and putting away guys fast. The art of mixed martial arts what I had to do. For fights, that's how I feel a lot of times, is... I feel calm, I'm cool, calm and collected. That's one thing that's always been instilled in my head. Uh, going back to my father, my father would always tell me, that, look, to stay cool, calm and collected in every situation you're in. You're never gonna make a good decision, Matt. You're never gonna make a good decision like being sad or anything like that. If you're cool, calm and collected, you know, that's when you make your best decisions. And whenever, I'm really quickly, really, really quickly, I, and I was that quick because, man, I'm already in shape, I didn't, and, I was just like, man, I want to get my UFC. I just feel like it's it's great just to be uh, calm in life because the minute you start getting mad, the minute you start getting sad, the minute you start getting anxious, like your your decisions in life are very skewed. Like you don't make the right decision for yourself at that moment. It's the people's champ. I'm some like a bowler. The candy paint dripping out for the old school and Paula. I'm with that big bank Hank, then Poppy Joe and Box. Trunk bump like chicken pox. Turn the base up just a notch. You see them blades chopping. You see that trunk popping. Hop it. This me in the club. The same in the parking lot bopping. To me, anytime I think of Houston, I think. <laughs> Houston was a really big, that's what Houston's all about. I just want people to know that I, I was a Houston. This is one of those places that, like, if you really strive for it, you can really get it.
Jimenez will be fighting in his home state of Texas at UFC Austin. Coming off a run along the Texas coast, Adrian Yanez trains out of Metro Fight Club in Houston, just 30 miles from his home. So just adding a little more weapons for kicks, elbows, knees. You just want to get comfortable throwing all the weapons. Yeah, so the process with which whenever Adrian took over the classes, uh, no one can replace Coach Saul Solis um, as somebody who has no pretty much very relatively little experience with MMA. He took me in with open arms with just a wealth of experience, but also tough love. And Adrian kind of took that over. The, the basics and the structure and the routine that Saul put us through, he puts them through. Um, She give me what I wanna Boss so hard, need a warm-up I back that at the warm-up yeah. Big time a stunner I'm out here on the come-up I beat the pussy drummer I roll up no more drama Womp, 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 womp She give me what I wanna Boss so hard, need a warm-up I back that at the warm-up yeah. Big time a stunner I'm out here on the come-up come I beat the pussy drummer I roll up no more drama Ask my mama for bread She told me uh -huh. Like, I, I, I really wanted those fights, bro. Now, now I can't get two of them back. Yeah. One of them is at the, is at the back of the line. Okay. Miles. Oh, yeah, yeah, he's way back. It's a full house today. That's what he wants to do with you guys. They saw Cam, they're like, we gotta come here. Okay, we gotta come here. It's all Cam. I'm sweating because I'm not hot. I'm yeah. hydrated. Now. <laughs> now. After what I left you. Can you shoulder bleed? No, we can't. <laughs>
Huh. 